Hello everyone on YouTube, Master of Cards here to bring you another card trick and boy did I have trouble coming up with a name for this one but I have so now I can film it so if we're all sitting comfortably I will begin like my last trick this is an unlisted trick that means it's not my spellbook yet but by the time you're watching it it will be so it's a bit of an anticlimax anyway this one's called Buried Treasure and no it's not probably not that good a name, but I'll explain why during the trick. So let's get into it then. So what I'm going to do first, I'm just going to give it a kind of shuffle. There we go, that should do it. And at the same time, let's go for the top card. Ten of spades, okay? Remember this everyone, today's card is the ten of spades. Okay, now I'm going to bury the card in the deck. Hence the name Buried Treasure. So here goes nothing. You're trying to get away with me. It's not going to work. There. You don't believe me? See? The top card is no longer the Ten of Spades. Now, at this point I'd have the spectator give me a number between 10 and 20 because that's where I think it's between. So, where there's no spectator, let's go for... Let's go for 12 since that's my favourite number. So. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve. Now I don't think it's there either. Let's narrow it down a little more. I know that we'll add the two digits together. So twelve is one and two. One and two makes three. Three is the magic number. So one, two, three. And here it is the ten of spades. <laughs> I guess we found the buried treasure. I know that's pretty bad joke. I think I'll end the trick there before this gets any worse. Well, that's the trick. I hope you liked it. I'll be back with some more soon. So until then, au revoir.